sick here and I went on a Top Shop, Zara, and a Reese haul. And usually every year around the same time, I go on a Top Shop and a Zara haul because in the beginning of July they have really, really good sales. And this year I was a little bit more smart about it than I was last year because last year they just have racks and racks and racks of sale items. And last year I got a bunch of shirts and a couple pairs of pants and I've yet to wear them just because I just got sucked into the sale and being like, oh, a $60 shirt for $15 and I've yet to wear it. So this year I really just picked out items that I needed, that I liked, and some of them weren't on sale, but I didn't mind because I wasn't spending money like I was last year on things that I never wore and that I didn't need. So let me just get on to show you what I got because some of the stuff is really cool and I really am enjoying it. The first um, top is from Top Shop, and this actually was from, um, I did the personal shopping there where they kind of help you find items. So I didn't pick this out that myself, they brought it to me. And you can see the bottom here has fringe hanging from it in the back and in the front. And it has a little bit of like a crochet to it, if you can see. And I think I'll probably wear this more in the winter and the fall, but I could wear this now even paired with like jean shorts. And when it's on, it looks like just amazing. And I just, I could not pass it up. It was actually a size bigger than what I normally wear. But when I find a top, even if it's a size bigger and I can still pull it off, um, and I love it that much, I will still get it because it was the last one. The next thing that I got actually was on sale, and I got it for like a tremendous steal. It was 90 and I got it for 24 and then it was like another, I think, 50% off. So I think I got this for about 10 or $12, and um, obviously I'll have to wear this because it's the summer. I'll have to wear this in the winter, but it's like a fuzzy material and it's so soft. So I'm really excited about that. The next thing I got was, as soon as I walked into Topshop, before I talked to any of the salespeople in there, I saw this top. It was hanging right in the front and I just gravitated right towards it. And I was like, oh my gosh, I want that top. And it was kind of funny because I went, when I went into personal shopping, I don't know if you've ever done that at Top Shop, they bring items to you, and sometimes you like them, sometimes you don't. Sometimes I've tried on things that I looked at, I'm like, I would never pick that out for myself. I would never like that. Um, and then I end up trying it on, and I'm like, this is amazing. So it's really kind of a cool thing to do, because you kind of end up finding things that normally you probably might have not have picked out on your own. So anyways, this top right away gravitated towards, and he ended up bringing it to me, so it was kind of funny, because I'm like, oh my gosh, I picked it out too, so he was like, yeah, a lot of girls are buying this, so it's kind of cool, but the only bad thing I could say about it was that um, the button here, you can see, kind of popped off, probably from whoever tried it on before me. So I have to get that fixed, but it came with extra buttons, but they gave me a nice discount because of that, so that was kind of cool. And the next thing that I got, and this is actually what I tried it on with to wear, is this little white skirt. And it's kind of got a little crochet kind of lace pattern to it, and it actually looks really cute together. It's a little longer in the back, so you kind of tuck it in. And it has a really deep V to it, so it looks really nice together. The next thing we're going to go on to is Zara. And the first thing I went in there, it has like three floors that the Zara I was at. And I actually didn't even go up to the other two floors because I wasn't going to get, like I was saying before, sucked into all the sale stuff. So, um... They had this dress downstairs, and I saw it right away, and I've actually been looking for a white dress. So right away, I saw it. It was like 50% off, and then another something off, and I was like, this dress is amazing. And I kind of like dresses with longer sleeves, so you can kind of wear them going into the fall. 
and it has like this little cute zipper detail in the back. So I got it for a really good deal and it's cute. It's a little um, wrinkly from traveling, but it was really nice. And then I wanted to get why I went into Zara was because I'm obsessed with their coats. I'm obsessed with their blazers. So I wanted to get two coats from there, either a coat and a blazer or two coats or whatever. So the first coat I got was this one. If I hold it up, you can see it. And it's just really cool. Actually, I will put it on really quickly so you can see it on. And I got it on sale. The two, everything I got at Zara was on sale. I don't know if I can step back, but you can see and it's kind of cool. And it's actually kind of reminds me kind of Chanel-like for some reason. And I really, really, really like it. And I don't have a coat this cream. Actually, I do have one cream coat this color, but it's a blazer. And another one that's like really, really wintery for like a winter blizzard. And the next coat that I got that could technically be a coat or could technically be a blazer was this pink one. And it's actually kind of cool too. I'll just pop it on real quick. And it's kind of, it's kind of really cool. And it's just got... If I come up really quickly, obviously over this outfit is not what I would wear it with. But it's kind of got a really cool cropped feeling to it, feeling to it, look to it. And it's just kind of really cool. And I thought I would really enjoy wearing this and making outfits with it. And I got it on such a good deal. And I love pink, obviously. If you've been watching my videos, you probably know that quite well. And the last thing I got was Reese, and I got this at Bloomingdale's. And if you actually research or know anything about Reese, um, it's actually a really, really cool brand. Like, whenever you see Reese in a store, it's kind of different from other brands. They actually rent the space, and they do something a little different even than renting the space. Like, they have their own Reese employees that um, are there with the clothing and that, are, that sell the clothing and they're, they're, they're very, very hands-on and the guy that owns it still owns it like 100% and um, if I sound a little hoarse, I have a little bit of a cold, so I'm, I apologize for that. But, um, so he's really hands-on with the brand, he's owned it the entire time and he's really proud of it, so that's why he kind of keeps it that way. So I'm a big, big fan of Reese. But I got this top and all of this was on like a tremendous sale. So it's just a plain white top. And I just love crisp white or black tops like that. And I'm going to pair it with this skirt. And it's just really cute. It's got these little pockets here. I love things that are actually true pockets. I just kind of look like them. And it kind of flares out at the bottom. I don't know, I don't know if you want to call it A-line. And that is it. And the only other thing I want to tell you is I'm kind of trying to pull off the denim on denim trend today. I'm not really sure if it's working. These weren't the jeans I wanted to wear. This is Topshop. Wasn't these? I wanted to wear them with my Topshop jeans, but I couldn't find them. And the only other thing I wanted to say was my makeup look today, I kind of went very natural. I'm using, I put it in here so I would remember the name. Um, L'Oreal Visible Lift Blur Foundation. I actually used the concealer, the Visible Lift Blur Concealer, and then I just used my um, Chanel, like it's like a three-in-one, like blush, contour, and highlighter. And then I just used my Givenchy. Um, it's really kind of cool. It's just like little pink. I'll come up kind of close. It's just this little pink. Um, Thing that just kind of brightens up your lips. So I just kind of went for like a really natural makeup look today because I thought it would look cute with the outfit. And I just didn't want to do too harsh of a face with the, with the denim trend. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you give it a thumbs up. I hope you subscribe. I apologize if I was talking too fast, but I have to be somewhere. And I hope you have a really good day and a really good weekend. And bye-bye.